Hello and welcome back to another video. The hub of all riches is California, possibly the most famous state in all of the US. One of the most popular destinations in all of North America, California is famous for the Golden Gate Bridge, Disneyland and Hollywood. For a normal wage person, it is the least preferred place to live. Let's take a look at the lavishness of California. The Hub of Billionaires of the 50 wealthiest people in America, 26 live in California. That's more than any other state and not simply a byproduct of California's large population. If the country's 100 top billionaires were evenly distributed, we would expect just six of them to reside here. Yes, this is large because of Silicon Valley, but that is not all. There are 724 billionaires in the United States and California is home to 189, roughly a quarter of the total, according to Forbes. 4% of California's billionaires made their fortunes in tech, followed by 23% in finance and 7% in real estate. Silicon Valley's tendency to mint billionaires has led to a startling trend. Of the 26 Californians who rank among America's 50 richest people, 19 live in the Bay Area. 35 people made California's billionaire list for the first time in 2021, Forbes reported and more than half of them had the tech industry to thank. California still has more billionaires than any other state. New York is second with 126. Living expenses California ranks six of the top 10 most expensive rental markets in the US. California cities in the top 10 now include San Francisco, San Jose, Los Angeles, Oakland, San Diego, and Santa Ana. Three of those cities are in the top five most expensive markets. If you have California beaches on your mind, make sure you take a close look at your monthly budget. California is the third most expensive state in the country, according to Merrick data gathered in 2021. The only US places that cost more are Hawaii and Washington DC. It's not just the number of mouths to feed that make groceries so expensive in California. It's also the fact that many people who live here have more money to spend on food than their counterparts in other states. California is the most expensive place to live in. The median home value is about $539,800. So make sure you are prepared to spend lots of money on transportation and housing in California. Not only that, but you will also have to spend a lot of money on all the necessities for your daily life. The demand of raw materials, labor and land is equally high in California, making the place costly. Each one of the lands takes more money from its actual price. The raw materials are very costly to purchase to make new buildings. Therefore, the property value and the cost of properties increased day by day. Expensive properties California is home to some of the wealthiest people in the world thanks to Silicon Valley and Hollywood. When you're making millions upon millions of dollars each year, you get to live in luxury. And the Golden State has lots of luxury. These mansions are located, predictably, in California's most expensive areas and neighborhoods, like Beverly Hills, Bel Air, Holmby Hills, and other parts of Los Angeles, as well as ritzy areas like Montecito and Malibu. You'll find homes with indoor pools, mansions that have over 40,000 square feet of living space, insanely expensive pools, enormous bathrooms, and enough marble to fill a quarry. Some are so over the top you probably wouldn't want to live there. Others are just downright awesome. The lowest price tag for the 20 most expensive homes in California is just $45 million, if that's to your liking. It goes all the way up to $115 million. It's owned by billionaire Steve Wynn, a real estate mogul and resort magnate. Celebrities Many famous Hollywood actors, musicians, singers, and filmmakers hail from this American state. Terminator actor Arnold Schwarzenegger, known for his great body and tremendous acting skills, hasn't just lived in California, but was also elected the governor of the state. Singer and songwriter Katy Perry, Academy Award winner Brie Larson, and Hollywood heartthrob Johnny Depp, singers Gwen Stefani and Jason Raz, as well as rapper Will I Am, are a few renowned residents of California. Famous actor Ben Affleck, who is immensely praised for his acting skills, hails from California as well. Other celebrities from Hollywood living in California include Dwayne Johnson, Leonardo DiCaprio, Angelina Jolie, and many more. Residentially, celebs like Tom Cruise, Sandra Bullock, The Beckhams, and Christian Bale had their nests here too. Bale resides just a few minutes away from the sand in the swanky Rustic Canyon neighborhood with his family. Cars 
You can see cars worth millions of dollars roaming around in California. The car scene in California is, in a word, ridiculous. Every neighborhood has its own vibe and distinct car culture. In Silver Lake, you'll regularly see sweet vintage Mercedes Benzes and obscure French oddities. But in West Hollywood and the neighboring Beverly Hills, supercars and high-end luxury machines rule the streets. You'll see more Mercedes G-Wagons than you will Toyota RAV4s. Rolls Royces are commonly found in grocery store parking lots and there are always Lamborghini Huracans at the local Starbucks drive through To the point where BMW and Mercedes models, even the top models, are of course so commonplace. Even Porsche models, except for the Carrera GT and 918, are common. Ferraris, Bentleys, Aston Martins, Maseratis, Lamborghinis and even McLaren cars are common to see every day around LA. Rolls-Royce, you might see one per week. A Bugatti, now that's something you might see once or twice a year. Shopping. In the market for some luxury splurging? Then set your sights on Montecito, California. This small town just south of Santa Barbara is home to fancier dresses and even fancier shops. And it's no wonder given that some of the country's wealthiest and most famous people live here. There are plenty of women's fashion boutiques in Montecito. The styles at Jenny Kane in the Upper Village give off a relaxed cool girl vibe, perfect for strolling along Butterfly Beach or catching a movie premiere during the Santa Barbara International Film Festival. Located adjacent to Beverly Hills, the Robertson Boulevard shopping district in West Hollywood is well known for celebrity sightings and the paparazzi that stalk the ivy during daytime hours. Everyone knows about Rodeo Drive, the city's most famous shopping street. Couture shops from high fashion's old guard are located along these three hallowed blocks, along with plenty of newer high-end labels. The 16 square block area surrounding Rodeo Drive is known as the Golden Triangle. Shops off Rodeo are generally not as name conscious as those on the strip, and you might be able to afford something, but they're nevertheless plenty upscale. Hotels. If you're looking to live the luxe life in Santa Barbara, it all starts with the hotel you choose to call home. There are many benefits to booking a luxury hotel that can cater to your every need and whim, so much so that you might never want to leave the grounds. Think signature restaurants serving three meals a day, cocktail bars stocked with local libations, gourmet room service on demand, pampering spa services, on-site wellness activities, and many more amenities to enhance your stay. Santa Barbara's diverse collection of ultra-luxurious hideaways presents a spectrum of price points and environments. These six luxury accommodations have mastered the art of hospitality and are always ready to roll out the red carpet to make you feel like a VIP. Once a citrus farm, San Isidro Ranch sits on 550 acres full of lavender, olives and oak trees and gardens, all framed by the Santa Inez Mountains. The resort's 38 bungalows were thoughtfully designed with cosy touches. Tourism it is one of the favorite tourist destinations. In comparison with population and land sizes, California holds the biggest share of the nation. The Golden State has more than 28 national parks and you would be awestruck visiting Joshua Tree, Sequoia, Ortega Falls, Escondido Falls, Yosemite and many more. After getting your work done, explore the scenic hiking trails in Southern California and I would suggest you hike to John Muir Trail, Wallace Creek, Eaton Canyon Trail, Half Dome at Yosemite National Park and many more. Yachts If you're not familiar with Kurt Strand's incredible yacht designs, this futuristic vessel will surely make you remember his name from now on. The brilliant yacht designer from Southern California has just revealed a 135 meter luxury yacht concept called California with a spectacular design that uses glass and water as key features. Unlike other companies that built their boats in the Far East, Californian yachts were built in Orange County, California and used mahogany for the interior instead of teak. Over the years, the Californian models earned an outstanding reputation in the industry for their above average construction standards, previously known as Wellcraft Marine Corporation and later Carver Yachts, the Marshall family has been building Californian yachts since the 1960s. Produced alongside the Navigator Yachts lineup, the American-owned and operated company has maintained distinctiveness in the design for California Yachts powerboats. The price for boats in California ranges from $2,880 up to $2,808,643, with an average boat value of $79,828. Quite an expensive leisure time activity, isn't it? Restaurants 
Fighting off great competition from its sister Cali cities, San Francisco comes out on top as the best city for food in California. It's the most restaurant-dense city in America, with countless awards to show for it. And many great American chefs have made their name in the American food scene via San Francisco. Let us know in the comments which one of these things fits in your budget, because it doesn't for us. That was it for this video. We hope you liked it. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you.